Hey guys, Stereo Dragon Gravity here again with a troll deck opening. So today, Descendants, Descendants of the Marine Emperor came out. Aqua Force, yeah. Can't wait to play with this deck. You'll get the 50 cards, etc. Playbook, map. Beyond. Let's go ahead and open it. Uh, do excuse the noise in the background because I am at a public place. So, got the tape off. Yeah. Naval Gazer Dragon. Really awesome. So, I'm gonna open it up and we'll go over the cards. in this nice little packet. All 50 cards. What is this? Here I guess. Of course rule books mapped. So let's start from the top. Uh, it does come with nasal naval gazer dragon. That is limit break four. Counterblast 2, this unit gets 3,000 turns of turn and gets ability. This unit attack hits a vanguard if you have it. If it is the third battle of a turn or more, choose up to two of your Aqua Force rear guards and stand them. So, really nice ability. Also, it gains 3,000 power when it attacks if it's the third battle or more of the turn. Then we have Marine Gen two, 2 Marine General of the Full Tides. Uh, don't know his name. Make it look weird. Uh, when the scenic attacks, if it's the third battle of the turn or more, the scenic gets 3,000 on Vanguard. When and on Rear Guard, when the scenic attacks, if it is, if you have an Aqua Force Vanguard and if it is third battle of the turn, the scenic gains 1,000. So or more. So then we have four K Anchor Debid. He looks pretty cool. I have no idea what he's doing there. He has like this sword anchor thing. Uh, his skill is kind of plus one when this unit attacks. You need to pay the cost, and this unit gets 3,000 to end a battle. So, pretty nice. Uh, now to the grade twos. We have four of the 10Ks. Tier Knight Lazarus. Again, he looks really cool with his awesome weird sword here. Uh, we get one in this weird pattern Marine General of the Restless Tides, Augus. Uh, his skill is when this unit attacks, so he's a vanguard. If you have an Aqua Force Vanguard and is the fourth battle or battle of the turn, you get a draw card. So that's why you run Stanters if you run him, because. You get that extra card. Very nice. Then we have two Coral Assault. His skill is when this unit attacks, if you have an Aqua Force Vanguard, and if it is the third battle of the turn or more, this unit gets 3,000 until end of turn. So, really nice for your Naval Gazer Dragon you can combo with. And then our last grade twos are. For Titan of Infinite Trench, he is your special interceptor. When it intercepts for an Aqua Force Vanguard, it gains its shield doubles in strength, so those are useful. Uh, for Grade Ones, we have four Tier Knight Theo. He is your 8K rear guard for Grade One. He looks real cool. He's on a ship with a gun or something. He has a long cape. He's really cool. So, yeah, he's cool. Uh, next we have... Four Tier Knights. Cypherus, I guess. Cypherus. How would you say that? Cypherus? I don't know. Cypress. Cypress. So we got four Tier Knight Cypress. He looks really cool. He has this awesome ski bow that shoots fire, apparently, with water wings. 
So he's really cool. Um, then we have two accelerated command. These are little weird horse fish things. They're really cool. Um, when they are placed on rear guard, choose one another of your aqua force and it gains 2,000. That's cool. Um, I didn't say his skill because just counter blast one, give him 1,000. Um, then we have one splash assault. When the student attacks, if you have a aqua force vanguard and this, and if it is the third battle or of that turn or more, this unit gets 3,000 ton of battle. So that's not. That's okay, I guess. He looks real cool. Besides this awesome jet ski thing. And an explosion behind him. And we have two battles Serene Siren Kathina. Uh, choose a card from her hand and discard it. When attack hits during the battle, the use the unit visited, you may pay the cost. If you do, draw a card. So basically, use your sh reshuffler. You get a bad hand. Great stuff. <laughs> Not bad. And then, ooh, more rarity pattern. Yeah. Uh, we have two Battle Siren Dorothea. When this unit boosts an Aqua Force Vanguard, if it is the third battle of the turn or more, the boosted unit gets 4,000. Not really, really good for this deck, because your Vanguard will most likely always be the third attack. Part of Aqua Force mechanics. Uh, then we have Officer of Officer Cadet of the First Battle. He is your starter. He looks real cool. He has this awesome spear right here. So he's cool. 6k grade zero. Only if it would move back. And then going on to the rest of the grade zeros and triggers. We have four Battleship Intelligence. He looks real cool. He's this awesome bike. Our man intelligence thing for a battleship. He's your critical trigger. He looks cool. No. Uh, next we have four draw triggers. That is Parlex communicate. I'm just gonna call him Sea Otter Soldier. He's Sea Otter Soldier, so I cannot pronounce that. Uh, he looks real cool. He has this awesome gem. He's floating. Draw trigger, yeah, he's cool. And then we have our stand triggers. We have Dolphin Soldier of High Speed Raids. Yeah, he's really cool. He's a dolphin. He has this like armor and jetpack for underwater. And again, stand triggers really good in this deck because its goal is to have money as tough as possible. So, and then we have our four heal triggers. Uh, medical officer of Rainbow Elixir. Of course, four heal triggers. Um, so this includes the video. We'll hopefully have more stuff with Aqua Force later. I really love this card, Naval Gazer Dragon. Can't wait for set eight with Blue Storm Dragon Maelstrom. So expect more Aqua Force in the video. To then, peace out.